Welcome and thank you for joining us. I'm Jessica Barbier, your host for the Cox OC Connection. It's summertime and we all know what that means. It's that time of the year again for Lobster Beach Fest. With us today to talk more about this great event from the Monarch Beach Sunrise Rotary Club, we have Russell Kerr, we have the new president as of today, John Kaufman, and from the Interact Club, we have the leader, Jessica Timberlake. Welcome and thank you for joining us. We're glad to be here. So let's jump right in. If you can tell us a little bit about the event and what makes it so different from all the other events we see here in Orange County. Well, this event is our annual fundraiser to raise funds for children's charities and for scholarships for deserving youth. And so we've felt for the last five years that this will be our fifth uh, Beach Fest, uh, that this would be a great place for a party on the beach, raise some money for our children's charities and for people to have a really good time, especially eating lobster. And what charities does you um, are you benefiting this year? This year we're benefiting some that we've benefited in the past, okay. like the Boys and Girls Club of Capistrano Valley, the Ocean Institute, the Dana Point Fifth Marine Support Group, and we've added a new one, the Make-A-Wish of Orange County. And we're excited to have them help us run the event this year as well. That's a great lineup of charities. How does the Rotary Club decide what charities benefit from this event each year? A lot has to do with what the members of the club feel are deserving. Mm -hmm. They may have their own personal connection and commitment to different charities. They may be others in the community. We like to support children that are local. Of course, Rotary is an international organization, so we also pledge some money from this event for ending polio around the world. Scholarships are chosen from the local high schools, particularly from children who may not be able to afford to go to college. And so we offer them a scholarship and a tutoring program. Wonderful. And John, what is going to be the difference from people that if they went last year and then they come this year? Is there going to be anything new um, elements that they can look forward to? Yeah, we have. We've added another uh, several new features to the Lobster Fest. Uh, this time when people show up at 4 o'clock, uh, there will be live music from the time they enter into the, the, the party grounds until the end of the evening. And this hasn't been the case in the past. We're also having some specialty uh, food stations uh, from restaurants uh, around Dana Point in the area to provide specialty dishes in addition to the lobster. So when people arrive, they'll be able to start snacking on hors d'oeuvres and other tasty morsels uh, from the minute they arrive. So those are some pretty uh, significant changes. That and we've, we've got a signature cocktail this year. Ooh, what is it? Is it a surprise? Uh, that's going to be a surprise. Okay. Sounds delicious. I'm gonna have to get two workouts in that morning. Jessica, can we talk a little bit about your involvement with the event and how um, you how it came to be? Absolutely. Um, well, the the club started um, the Lobster Fest five years ago, so this is our fifth annual Lobster Beach Fest. And because it's our fifth Beach Fest, we really that's where we really wanted to make it extra fun with having multiple bands, a signature cocktail, offering some different types of dishes. Um, I've been involved with the event for a couple of years, so I've been fortunate enough to see it grow to the amazing event that we're expecting this summer. Um, and, you know, as part of the Interact Club at Dana Hills High School, Interact is a high school version of Rotary. So we rely on a lot of the Interactors, as we call them, to come to the event and volunteer their time as well. Even though it's summer, <laughs> they're taking time out of their precious summer for, um, for school and participate in the event, whether it's serving lobster, busing tables, or maybe even one of the waiters at our special big tail tables. So. That's a great collaboration. So let's get into the nuts and bolts of the event. The event date, the time, where people can buy tickets, and the ticket price. Well, it's gonna be held on Saturday, August 16th, starting at four o'clock, and Old State Beach is closed by 10. So we'll be out of there by then. Okay. And they can buy their tickets online at danapointlobsterfest.org. Okay, and how much are tickets? The tickets this year are the same price as last year and the year before and the year before that. Still $75 okay. for a regular ticket in. We have a full service big tail table where you have some additional servings of food and drink and alcohol and that's $150. A little more upscale than the $75 ticket. And what does general admission include? General admission gets you into the grounds, gets you uh, a plate of lobster, and all the trimmings that go with it, the seafood dishes that John mentioned, as well as delicious dessert from some of our great sponsoring restaurants like Donna B's. Yeah, you guys have some really great restaurants in Dana Point. And if we can give the website to our viewers where they can go and buy tickets. It's at danapointlobsterfest.org. 
Okay, wonderful. And um, I, before we close, I just wanted to do a quick overview of what Elsa Rotary is working on. As the new president, I will give this question to John. Um, what are some of the initiatives and programs you're currently working on? Well, I tell you, one of the most important that Russell mentioned is the End Polio Now program. Mm -hmm. uh, this has been going on for 30 years or so. Uh, and Rotary has been one of the main drivers behind this uh, major initiative. And if you ever look at a Rotary website or talk to anyone who's been involved in this, now we're at the point where we're saying we are this close. Uh, there are just a handful of countries around the world, uh, uh, less than a handful, that still have incidents of polio. Mm -hmm. So when we say we're this close, uh, that is very real, mm -hmm. and by 2018, we believe we'll be there. So this is a major thing for us. It is. Well, congratulations on that work. Uh, we look forward to seeing you at Lobster Fest, Lobster and Beach Fest, because there it's so go. much more than lobster. It's grown over the past several years, and um, we'll be on your website to buy the tickets. But thanks for all the work that you're doing with the Rotary Club and with Interact, and we look forward to seeing you Saturday, August 16th. Thank you, Jason. And we'll be right back after this quick break. It's Lobster Beach Fest time. Come join the fun at the Dana Point Lobster Beach Fest at Doheny Beach on Saturday, August 16th, hosted by the Monarch Beach Sunrise Rotary Club. Enjoy gourmet appetizers, no host bar, steak, lobster, desserts, two live bands, DJ dancing, and an amazing silent auction. Proceeds go to local charities including Make-A-Wish, Boys and Girls Club, and more. Buy your tickets today at DanaPointLobsterFest.org. 